Welcome to StartCooking.com. I'm Kathy Maester. Today, we're making crepes with a Nutella filling. An ingredient and equipment list is at the end of this video. Start by putting two tablespoons of butter into a large bowl and melt it in the microwave. Now add one cup of whole milk, one third cup of water, two large eggs, and one teaspoon of vanilla. With a whisk, or an electric mixer, or a blender, blend these wet ingredients together. Next, the dry ingredients. Sift onto a piece of wax paper, one cup of flour, one fourth teaspoon of salt, and two tablespoons of sugar. Add the dry ingredients to the wet ingredients and blend everything together really well. The batter should be very smooth. Pour the batter back into your two cup measuring cup. Cover it with some plastic wrap and refrigerate the batter for at least two hours or up to two days. If you don't let the batter rest, your crepes will end up very rubbery. Time to make the crepes. If the ingredients have separated, gently stir them together. Heat a non-stick fry pan over medium high heat. You can use a six or seven inch, or a nine or 10 inch, or a crepe pan. Just be sure it's non-stick. Melt one half teaspoon of butter in the pan. Brush the butter over the surface of the pan with a heat resistant brush. You should hear it sizzle. For a 9 to 10 inch pan, use a full 1 4th cup batter per crepe. Pour the batter into the pan with one hand, and with the opposite hand, swirl the pan until the batter coats the bottom of the pan. Cook the crepe until it's a patchy light brown on the bottom, about 30 seconds to 1 minute. With a spatula, loosen the edges of the crepe and flip it to the other side. Cook the second side until it's spotted brown and dry, about another 30 seconds. Remove the crepe from the pan and place it on a cooling rack while you continue to make more crepes with the remaining batter. Add more butter to the pan if the batter starts to stick. To store leftover crepes, stack them between squares of wax paper in a Ziploc bag in the refrigerator for up to three days or frozen for up to two months. To fill the crepes, put the side you cooked first facing down. Spread some Nutella over one half of the crepe. Fold it up. Sprinkle on some powdered sugar, garnish with a bit of fruit if you like, and dig in. Cheers! For the ingredients you need, butter, eggs, whole milk, vanilla, flour, salt, sugar, and Nutella. For the equipment you'll need, liquid measuring cup, dry measuring cup, measuring spoons, wax paper, fine mesh strainer, mixing bowl, a blender, an electric pan mixer, or a whisk, nonstick fry pan or a crepe pan, heat resistant brush, a cooling rack, a flipper, and a knife to spread the Nutella. 